All right, let's get to this really quickly because I, I thought this was kind of fascinating. So John Kerry was on um, – he was basically doing the rounds uh, yesterday on Sunday. He was on multiple outlets and from one location. From, from one location. So, you know, they set him up in a, in, a, in, a, in a studio. He had a feed. He was on multiple shows. This is uh, – Right before he went on Fox News with Chris Wallace, and actually I, I watched the whole interview. It was pretty contentious, um, and, and Kerry held his own on the kind of big picture of Obama's foreign policy. And then at one point in the interview, it's very interesting because Chris Wallace says, we caught you on a hot mic, and I want to play it. If you look at Kerry's face, and when you watch this clip on YouTube, I've seen politicians get ambushed by this type of thing before, and they look like I remember one time Gordon Brown, the former British prime minister, they caught him insulting a voter on a hot mic, and they literally was they were telling him that they had this clip. He just went like he literally put his hand in his face, face palm. He face palmed himself and just looked like, oh my god, my life and career are over. John Kerry doesn't seem all that surprised about this. Uh, so we'll talk about what's going on here with this clip. Um, but anyways, this is Kerry. He's talking to one of his aides, and he's talking about Israeli operations uh, in Gaza. And Chris Wallace sets him up uh, by explaining what he's going to play. This is about 30, 40 second clip. Let's play it. While you're, you're doing a series of interviews with all of the networks, and while you were on camera, and while you were on microphone, you just spoke to one of your top aides in between the interviews. Uh, about the situation in Israel and the fact that 14 Israelis uh, have either been shot or killed in an operation. Uh, we want to play a clip of that conversation because it's an extraordinary moment of, of diplomacy. Take, take a look at this. Yeah. It's a hell of a pinpoint operation. It's a hell of a pinpoint operation. Right. It's escalating significantly, uh, significantly and it just underscores the need for, for ceasefire. We've got to get over there. <clears throat> Thank you, John. I think, John, we ought to go tonight. I think it's crazy to be sitting around. Secretary Kerry, uh, when you said it's a hell of a pinpoint operation, are you upset that the Israelis are going too far? Okay, so basically, John Kerry went on and, and pivoted, and he pointed out uh, you know, that Israel is targeting some tunnel networks, which is how Hamas uh, moves some arms shipments. But he did also say, look, I am responding in a human way to civilians dying and children dying, and that is what's happening in Gaza. Um, this is off the heels a couple of weeks ago, or maybe even a couple of months ago at this point, of what was a genuine, uh, it was taken, it was supposed to be off the record and it was reported uh, anyways, where John Kerry warned of, Israeli, of Israel becoming an apartheid state. Um, and that, I'm sure, he did not want on the public record. I think that was definitely done intentionally. I don't think John Kerry's an idiot. I think he's aware of what a hot mic is. And I think that there is a profound frustration level within the administration at what's happening here um, in Gaza. 